Hey, Pastor Steve Waldron here. I hope you're having a great day in Jesus. You know, one of the great proofs to me about Scripture is the Bible is correct in incidentals. Now, what do I mean by incidentals? Well, it'll be describing a situation. It'll be describing how somebody's dressed. It'll be describing how somebody's conducting business. And when you find in archaeology, you find that all these things are accurate in the incidentals. When you have the life of Jesus, you know, he's going from this city to that city to he's taking a boat from here to there. And all of those things it's accurate in the incidental. So it's going to have like overarching themes. It's going to have, you know, grace, love, mercy, truth, holiness, wisdom, and uh, teachings, you know, doctrines and all this. But then in incidental things that it's talking about, you know, whether somebody's a sheep herder or a, a gatherer of sycamore fruit, whether it's, you know, I turn to Genesis 23 where Abraham is conducting business trying to buy a place of burial from Ephron the Hittite, I believe it is, that, you know, Machpelah, that, well, when they discovered contracts of that time, that's exactly how the business would be transacted, weighing unto them 400 pieces of silver, uh, the servitude of Israelites in Egypt, uh, the fact of viziers in Egypt, all kinds of things that... Uh, the Bible's just accurate in its incidentals. Coats of many colors, like in Joseph's time or in uh, David's daughter's you know, time, she had a coat of many colors as well. The, the Bible's just accurate in incidentals. This is what happened to William Ramsey you know, when he went to the uh, Mediterranean to disprove Christianity. He was going to write the definitive work against Christianity and he decided to, to start with Luke. And so after several years, when he came out, with his work, he had converted to Christianity, much to the chagrin of his friends in in the UK, because they all thought he was writing this definitive defeat against, and he came out with a definitive in the affirmative, saying that Luke was the most accurate of historians in the ancient world. Lou Wallace did the same thing. You know, he was trying to disprove Christianity, and he said after eight years, he finds himself on his knees like Thomas, saying, my Lord and my my God, because Jesus, it's just the most uh, actuated and uh, attention to detail proof of any ancient literature. Everything happened just the way the Bible said that it was going to happen, even in the incidentals. So the Bible is correct in the incidentals, and that's one of the greatest proofs of its authenticity. And if it's right in the incidentals, it's right in the big things too. So you and I better get right with Jesus. We'll talk with you later. God bless you in Jesus' name.